All right. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, or morning, afternoon, evening, night, whatever it is, wherever you're at, whenever you're watching this. Um, it's actually pretty early in the morning for me. It's about 5 a.m. I woke up at 2 o'clock and haven't been able to sleep. Got to go to work in a couple hours, so I figured I'd listen to a little bit of music and get the day started. Um, this group I saw on my feet a good bit. They're fairly new. I did do a little bit of research on them. It's left. Seraphim, I believe I'm pronouncing that correct, which is an anagram of I'm Fearless. And um, this is their recent song, Unforgiven, featuring Nile Rodgers, who I actually am not familiar with. But let's go ahead and get my head shorter or smaller over in the corner. And this is first time listening to Les Seraphim, and let's see how it goes. Unforgiven. I can tell early on this is a pretty high quality music video production. I'm glad that people have started putting a lot more work into their music videos. There for a while. You know, they kind of went out of favor, and most groups didn't put much work at all into them after the death of MTV. But seeing them come back with some high quality productions. Uh. Got almost a coyote ugly vibe in a fancy restaurant. Okay, yeah, I'm really liking the quality of this video and the quality of the music. The, the beat's really catchy. <laughs> I like that, but I ride. That, that's a pretty line, the way she says that. And I like the horse, that just the position of the horse. I like the switch in between the white and black. So then you know the symbol symbolism there, switching between the white and the black, and then also now you've got the white feather burning. Uh -oh. oh, now pink. So we're gonna go get putting some color into it. We went from white and black to pink. Oh, got some red blood. Now this, I like this is kind of sought in that sepia um, filter, where it isn't so vivid, and you got you know that old you know seventies vibe sepia look.
I just think white, black, white and black. See, now they just look like modern, modern dancers. You know, yeah, I've got just cool street clothes on. Now this almost looks like a cowboy movie from the 50s. They're gonna be anything at the end. All right. I actually really enjoyed that video. I love the use of color in it and the uh, just the juxtaposition of colors with the black and white. In the representing different eras in time with the villains and the, you know, kind of that theme running throughout it. And it was a very catchy song as well. I believe I will probably, probably you know, not get to it this morning, but maybe sometime within the next day, check out their first song, I'm Fearless, and see how it is. Please like and subscribe, and have a great day. Thank you.